Hello everyone, this is Zeppelin G993 doing level 11 Crucifix Hill, which is my least favourite level. <laughs> it's just long, annoying, tough in some places. So yeah, it's alright I suppose, because it's all white right missions. Some better than others, and this is just a bad one in my opinion. Right then, Crucifix Hill, Ellendorf Ridge, Germany, September 14th, 1944, 6.10am. And we're in a boat. I'm on a boat. Everybody look at me because I'm here. Ain't gonna make it. What you expect? A battleship? Keep paddling. I would, but I've got an oar. If you don't have an oar, use your rifle butt. Just paddle. Okay. Whoa. That could have been us. Nice. Paddle, Smitty, paddle. I would, but I've got a paddle or a rifle butt. Do it. Yes, the Lord is our shepherd. Oh, I'm glad to be out there. Look at that rain, honestly. <laughs> the bombs are one thing, but the rain. Right, so there's five of us. Let's do this. Oh, I'm free. Screaming me. Right, yo, so we've got the bar and the M1 carbine. Pretty good weapons. A nice difference from a Thompson and the always have the M1 go around, don't we? So yeah. Anyway. A bit weird though saying that, because M1 go around is a very good weapon. I prefer it to the carbine. But oh well, it will do. So make your way up the road, keep behind the Jeeps, and then stick up the Germans along the way. And then follow Kelly and Schmidt along the road. And Schmidt is now a corporal. So good on him. That took half as much time to him hit from a corporal than Russia did anyway. <laughs> oh, there goes Russia, Sherman. What right now, Sarge? Follow me! What am I saying that for? I'm a sergeant. <laughs> I'm the same ranking as good old Kelly. Alright, let's see what we got in here then. At this point I thought Kelly had, well, hadn't gone with us, but he actually had. So my bad. Right. We've now got to get through this cemetery, which is ahead of us. And this is one of the first annoying parts of this mission. It can be... Actually, you can sit there forever and fire and there's more men will appear. So all you've got to do is simply go around on the outside. When you get to there, get low, because they'll rip you apart otherwise. And then slowly make your way through the cemetery. Fight them, and of course, more and more men will come. You can't stop that, unfortunately. It's just making a way through whenever there's a clear moment. And they always appear in random places. There's no set ones, unfortunately. Right. So you're not making any progress at all. So I'm taking a risk for it. And surprisingly, it's paid off, it's a bit. I think grenade's gone off around me. So, they're gonna have one of mine in return. Ha ha! How's it like that? Am I being killed? Help! <laughs> uh, any more of those German bastards? No offense to anyone who's German and watch this. <laughs> Oh dear. What a lovely place this is. Dark, raining. Guns going up around us. Give us a couple of machine gun nests and we'd be having a party. <laughs> Ooh, hell. <laughs> I mean, what that lower health actually? I don't know what like three. But still, it's always better to be full health then. Just off full health. Make a way around here, this is quite good. Um, usually it's quite good cover, I find, even though I'm being torn to shreds when I look around the corner. I actually found once that I was distracted by my men. I was watching Brooklyn Fire for some reason, and then I was instantly torn to pieces by the guy who was firing at me. I didn't realise he was, so don't do that. Always concentrate on killing the enemy, not whether. Brooklyn is throwing grenades, or Kelly is cowering, or Schmidt is praying that God will save him, you know, that sort of thing. Right, 
back to where we are now. This can be one of the most annoying bits in this level. Because there is an MG42 nest beyond that gateway there. And if you just run towards it, you'll be dead in a second. They will literally wipe you out. So you've got to be careful and bide your time. Right. See, look, we now. Here it comes. You've got to make your way around the outside and keep as low as possible. Make sure that you can, um. You're not line of fire at any time. And as soon as you get to like the little wall bit, and as long as you've got enough health, simply make a dash for it and hope for the best. If you can, when you get to here, try and take out as many of them as many as possible. Grenades are always good, of course. Whoa, I'm being torn to pieces like I said I would be. Right. This is it. Ah! Also, once you get back to here, you get a little checkpoint reached. Bit. And mind, that is worth getting because otherwise you're back to the start of the century. And once you get something out of the way, it's a whole lot easier to start to find. But easier, still a reasonably difficult level. Because we are getting towards the end of the game after all. But still, it's yeah, still money's favourite level. I said it before, and I'll probably say it again during this walkthrough piece. <laughs> Put grenades and everything on there. Yep, I think we're fine. Right, pick up the three black wheelings. So we're still not onto the screaming memes yet. They come towards at the end of the mission. It's all about them, as they bomb us, and pound us with bombs <laughs> from the top of Crucifix Hill, I suppose. What we call it. The bar's a great gun actually, I love it. But uh you never have that much ammunition I find. I use that really quickly. There's the M1 combined, there's soldiers dying around you constantly. There's you, Kelly and Schmidty, and they're all together. And then like you have two soldiers. And when they die, look behind you and there'll be two more running up to replace them. And of course you get the three M1 combine them. Oh, but you seem to be the only person there for bar, so that disappeared really quickly. And while I'm in right in line of sight of a German. No time. I should have killed him. And it didn't! It's the final laws of physics, that is. Oh, he's dead now. <laughs> I'm not playing shot him. Yes, Mini, I got I thought that first. <laughs> We're all good. Yeah, a bit more help. Yeah, as I said, this mission will go on forever. So far I've got about four parts filmed for this. So, maybe maybe even five, I'm not sure. I had to stop filming during the level because like, ugh. I started playing it quite late and I thought I'd get it undone quite quickly. But I didn't, so I do like give up halfway through. Maybe than that, two thirds of the way through I think actually. I still had a fair bit to go. I was on four parts then, so four or five parts this level will be. We've got two more levels left after this, a two part level, and we're done. Finished for the duty. Anyway, back to the task in hand. Make way up along the path, clean out the retired bits along the way. There's a guy there. Get rid of him. Is this room clear? It is. Right. That's it for now then. In the next part we should continue making our way up Crucifix Hill and join the back feelings. See ya!